Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another episode of our Pokemon Alpha Sapphire Hardcore Randomized Nuzlocke. Cards aren't in yet, guys. I'm sorry. I'm back to back recording, but again, they should be here today. Uh, all that to say, I'm really excited to jump into this one. And if you missed the previous episode, we did some really awesome things. We got Drew leveled up quite a bit. I think he's now the highest level Pokemon on the team. He leveled up so fast. Uh, on top of that, we did actually secure that third gym badge, which is excellent. And uh, we actually caught a really cool Larvitar, naming it Brianna for the subscriber. So lots of really cool stuff. One thing I want to do really quickly, I did a very, very quick run through of uh, gettable items, we'll say, uh, in this uh, in this area. And most importantly, I wanted to just grab some TMs. Uh, so I did look. It looks like there are two TMs and the bicycle kind of up for grabs. Uh, so we're going to do that really, really quickly. And then we're going to head to the left here where um, we actually have a handful of things we can do. Um, what was the there it is. Uh, do, 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 but we do need to grab the bike first. Sorry, I got super into the music there for like two seconds. Uh, let's grab the acro bike, perhaps. Are you the guy? No, the other guy's the guy. We need this guy. All right. Uh, really excited, by the way, guys, because I'm finally, finally kind of getting ahead on some things. Um, I feel like it's been a long time since I've been able to, like, officially say I'm ahead, if that makes sense. Uh, but specifically in the two long form content series is <laughs> I've been really working hard to get as far ahead as I possibly can. I was going to see where is uh, it might be upstairs. I don't know. Um, and I'm not that worried about this, but uh, I, I like getting free TMs. <laughs> So it's probably worth it. Nope, 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 nope. Um, it's probably worth it to at least, you know, see what we got going on. Uh, but maybe we go up here. Um, oh, I love this. I forgot all about this. Look how pretty it is. Oh, take a good look at that. Beautiful. All right. Um, dude, I, I love this game. <laughs> This is such a beautiful game. I do. Uh, yeah. Worth it. Totally worth it. I'm so glad that I, I told her how much I love Pokemon. If I didn't do that, I wouldn't have had that Poke toy. What? Um, no, I don't want that. Uh, let's see. I guess it's not up here. I just thought I'd look. <laughs> All right. Let's head back down. I know that was an O power guy, but we're not going to use O powers. So let's be honest. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, so somewhere in here is a cafe and that's actually what I'm looking for, but I'm also not that concerned about it. Um, it's it's just a TM, but like, you know, a TM's a TM. want to want to do what we can do here. Uh, all right. Well, for now, let's head out this way. Because we got an encounter waiting for us over here, guys. Route 117. Uh, yep, there we go. So there's a handful of things that are going to be going on in this uh, section of the game. Obviously, we've got this is all basically like not necessary to do at the moment. Um, but I think a good idea to do at the very least. Uh, and so we are going to take the opportunity while we're here. Uh, we're going to gain a few levels on our team. I believe level 28 is the level cap. It looks like that is the case. Uh, and this is a, a new encounter for us, which is great. So Spritzy and Altaria. Mega Altaria. Fantastic. Excellent. <laughs> um, OK, well, I guess I can just Diamond Storm. Seems pretty good. I'm going to swap some on out here, though, uh, just to be on the safe side. I think that's smart. Um, maybe Angel. Angel would be fine. Diamond Storm might do quite a bit. We'll see. Oh, it lands. I think it's 95 accurate. Maybe I'm wrong. I did quite a bit. Safeguard on their side. That's fine. Calm mind. Hey. Chill out. <laughs> You're a spritzy. Calm down. Um, I'm going to Diamond Storm again. Uh, and then I'm actually going to Draining Kiss the Altaria here. 
It avoided. Which one avoided? Was it Altaria or was it? No, it was not Altaria. Okay, that's probably good. Defense rising. I love that. I think round special, so it doesn't matter, but that's still fine. Draining Kiss? It is super effective given the dragon typing, and we do take the Altaria down. Love it. That's really, really good. Hector gaining a level right off the bat. Absolutely love to see it. Uh, and Angel getting a good bit. Saman also gaining a level, level 21. Saman's got a long way to go before uh, getting to Drapion level, but I'm really excited to get to Drapion level. I think obviously it's going to be great if we can get there. Um, it's just going to take some time. That's all. I'm just going to water pulse the spritzy. It shouldn't really matter that much. Yeah, I think that was kind of an easy KO. Um, there are a lot of battles in this little section, uh, which is kind of fun. It means we get to just kind of chill and hang out today. Relax a little bit. Have some fun with some battles, man. Let's pick some berries. Um, there's also a handful of items, I believe, kind of scattered around Route 117. So we might actually be able to pick up something awesome. Uh, again, randomized items mean we could get a Master Ball, which would be really nice. Uh, one thing I do want to mention, I, I did mention it at the end of the last episode, but I want to kind of jump in on it now. Um, somebody did mention that we might have accidentally, and if it is a thing, it would have been accidentally, uh, put full odds catches on, so like everything's a guaranteed catch. That is not the case. I did double check that. We've gotten lucky with a lot of catches, but we did not put full odds on. Uh, so I will just go ahead and throw that out now. Drizzle from the Zapdos. That's actually really good with like thunder. Um, but I'm going to D storm. Should be fine. It is a Zapdos, which is scary, but we're a, a defensive buffed Raichu. So I'm, I'm feeling good about it. And Peck is silly. <laughs> I'm just going to quick attack. It detects. Really? Okay. Let's, let's let's do it again. Please knock it out. Awesome. Did it. A Zapdos would be so sick, dude. <laughs> I love Zapdos so much. Uh, and Drizzle Zapdos, like that's so good. Um, kind of broken good. All right. Do we want to get the encounter first? I think yeah. Let's do the encounter. Let's see what we get here, guys. Route 117 encounter. What's it gonna be? A Flygon. Ooh, I really like Flygon. Um, this might be a little tricky. We'll see. Uh, let's... Ooh, I actually shouldn't have stayed in. It has Sand Tomb, doesn't it? Oh, no. Guys, I messed up. We're trapped. We're very trapped and super dead. Um... I literally have to throw a ball. I, oh no, I can't believe I've messed up this badly. Okay, now I'm starting to question everything I just said. I didn't, I need to check. I, I did check earlier and I used the exact same settings as the Y Nuzlocke. So I'm really confused as to why this is a thing. I mean, I'm not mad that we caught a Flygon, but I'm curious as to what's going on there. We'll see, we'll we'll evaluate that and make sure we're doing the right thing here, guys. I'm not trying to intentionally cheat by any means. So if there is a mess up, it's on my end uh, and we'll figure it out. We're gonna name this Phoenix for Phoenix the dog. Uh, Let's see. It is also just level 14, so there is a world where it's not. I don't know. We'll see. I feel like it should be harder to catch stuff, so maybe you're right. I checked. Everything seemed fine. I'll do it again. All right. Uh, let's run back heal and check up on uh, Phoenix here. Phoenix the dog, thank you so much, by the way, for being awesome. Um, I just want to see what the ability is on this, mostly. Flygon's really good. I would definitely consider adding Flygon. It's also a ground type, uh, which is pretty solid for us, um, just in terms of giving an electric community. Granted, we already do have Raichu, but um, I think that's actually probably just better. It is a dragon type, uh, and we technically already have a dragon type with Mega Sceptile, but we'll see. 
All right, let's check it out. Swarm. What does Swarm do? Anything? Powers up bug type moves if the Pokemon's in trouble. I mean, that's fine. Um, minus attack nature is not great, but it is a plus speed nature. That's interesting. I'm not going to do any changes now, though. I like our team, honestly. Um, no offense, but Saman is probably like the weakest, but it's also long term one of the best. So I feel like we should keep it. Um, so anyway, long story short, we're going to keep going. That was really, really good, though. Uh, let me make sure I mark it so we can get a card for you, Phoenix. Um, all right. Let's head this way. Battle you. Uh, again, we're just going to be laying back, having a good time today. Hopefully having some good battles. This person has six Pokemon. <laughs> Jeez. All right. Well, here we go. Welcome to the gauntlet, everybody. Um, thankfully, it's hopefully flying type. If it's normal type, I guess that's fine. But um, I'm hoping it's flying type. It is normal type. If you don't know, Azuril is a normal type. It doesn't gain the water typing until later. That's fine. We'll be fine. As long as there's not like a slacking. Are you normal rock? Is that what you are? I don't know. We're just going to T-bolt you, man. Hector, just sweep. Fine. Not a problem. Uh, we're going to swap Hector out after this battle, though, because Hector is definitely going to be getting some levels. Um, and again, level 28 being the... Uh, we've got a lot to do, actually, before level... Or before the next um, gym. Hotney. Okay. Is it fairy, then? Maybe it's fairy type. That makes sense. That makes sense. Let's go river here. Uh, cotton spore. Okay. What do you do? Our speed harshly fell. Well, that's fine. Let's alleviate that problem. Leech seed. You're annoying. Um, I'm so confused. I literally checked the randomizer settings. Like I, so for those of you who don't know, uh, there's a randomizer program that you use to randomize these games when you create a randomized Nuzlocke. I have saved settings for all of these, so what I do is I go through, set everything the way I want it, and then save it, so that way if I do have to re-randomize or restart, all I have to do is load in uh, the settings that I had previously, and it's all, it does it all for me. I do double check it every time just to be safe. Sometimes I'll miss something or whatever, and so I like to make sure I've checked it. However, in this case, what you can do is like load up a ROM and load the settings and check to make sure that everything was OK. That's exactly what I did. Everything was fine. I didn't touch the catch rate. So I'm a little confused as to why this is a thing. Like, I'm not complaining because it means we're catching everything. But I also want to be safe and make sure that I didn't accidentally like drag it across or whatever, because it is like a little slider. I didn't, according to the settings. And so now I'm just confused. <laughs> like. Are we just that lucky or is something else going on that I'm not aware of? I, I don't know. I, I'm i at a bit of a loss uh, and I'm a little upset because I don't want to make the game too easy. Uh, I feel like that's cheating you guys out of an opportunity, really. Uh, and so I do want to make sure that I'm being as fair as possible for all of you guys uh, and myself. I want a fair run. I don't want to cheat. Um, oh, perfect. <laughs> Um, anyway, we'll figure it out. I, again, I checked it. I'll do one more check. But after that, guys, I don't really know what else I can do. Um, it seems like everything's fine. So I, I don't know. Uh, all right. Maybe we'll test the theory on like a, a catch or a, a potential encounter. We'll just like straight up throw a Pokeball and see what happens. But right now. We're just going to knock out this Ivysaur. No problem. Nailed it. Uh, River should maybe gain a level. Yeah, River's getting up there. Um, I'm really excited to get River evolved. I'm curious to see what the final ability will be. That's always exciting. Angel getting a level as well. That's fantastic. El Hombre. Um, that's actually a bit of an annoying Pokemon, isn't it? I wish we had a flying type move. Um, 
Let's try Saman out, man. We haven't hadn't used much of Saman this episode. Let's see if we can do it. We're also 15 minutes in. Crazy. Crazy, crazy. Bubble. Do it. Um, one thing I want to mention, so for those of you who don't know, um, the short series stuff, if you only watch the long form content, you should definitely check out the shorts as well. I always have a Nuzlocke going on. I post every day uh, on shorts a Nuzlocke that I'm doing. Um, those videos also get pushed over to Instagram as well as TikTok, so you can definitely follow me there if you're interested. I'd certainly appreciate it. Don't feel like you have to. Obviously, this is kind of the big platform, but any of the other ones are certainly appreciated. Excuse me. But what's happened kind of randomly on Instagram uh, is, for whatever reason, the the shorts seem to be blowing up quite a bit there. Uh, and in fact, one of them almost has 60,000 views, which is insane. I've literally I've done YouTube for a long time, uh, not in Pokemon, but just in general. I've had like I've had some Oh, dude, a Metang would have been sick. I've had some really good videos do fairly well, uh, at least for the level that I've always been at. So like I've been I've been very thrilled about the, the outcome of certain videos here and there to see one hit nearly 60,000 views. And it does keep kind of raising uh, is insane. Absolutely insane. It's amazing. So thank you to all of you guys over on Instagram who've been checking stuff out. I really do appreciate it. Uh, if you're not over on Instagram, I highly encourage you to go there. Um, you won't be getting anything new as of right now. Occasionally I do post uh, like collection stuff. So just some photos of cards that I've picked up. And in fact, got a handful of graded cards, things like that right here. Um, but in general, it's mostly just the shorts that get post posted over there. Uh, but I'd really appreciate any and all support and everywhere that you guys can be supportive and helpful is awesome. Um, don't feel like you have to. Don't stress. Not, not anything like that. Just something to consider if you're interested. Um, so I think this is the final battle. And then we are at Verdanturf Town, which is perfect. Right at 17 minutes or so. That's good. Charmander. Let's go. Fire type. That means Angel is going to rock it. All right. Let's water pulse away a Charmander. I really wish we had a Charmander. I feel like when I first started this channel, I feel like every run that I did, I ended up somehow with a Charizard. Speak of the devil. Uh, but for whatever reason, over the last handful of runs, that just hasn't been the case, which I'm not complaining. I really like trying out new Pokemon. I think it's more fun. Um, and like Gorbis, as an example, that's not a Mon that I've ever really used in a Nuzlocke before, but it's really exciting to use a, a Gorbis because it's different, right? Something new. Um, OK, this just escalates. Um, anyway, it's really fun. Um, but it, it is kind of funny how that works. I feel like I go through seasons of using certain Pokemon above others, and it's all based on what I find, obviously, right? So that's kind of the fun of randomizing, as you just never know. Uh, but it's interesting how that works. For a long time, I felt like I was always getting a Charizard in every run. We named them Nova every single time, because at the time, I wasn't naming them after subscribers, but um, I'm happy to say we're doing that now, which is way better. But uh, what does Captivate even do? Um, that's cool, but no, I'm not going to do that. Um, anyway, so yeah, like it just feels kind of silly or not silly, but just kind of weird how that works out. Sometimes you go through these ebbs and flows of finding particular Pokemon. D-Rage. Wow. Hey, calm down, brother. Um, I don't want to switch into this. Um... What do we do? I missed. I missed Water Pulse. That's what's scary. Please don't derage. OK, cool. That's all I wanted. I just didn't want to. So that's why that's annoying. I want a T-Bolt and not Diamond Storm just to get max chance of knocking this thing out here. <laughs> Diamond Storm would do more potentially, but like more importantly is hitting the move. <laughs> um, it's nice this is the last trainer, though, because it does mean that we can just heal up at the end of this and we'll be good to go. Magmar going down in one shot. Love it. Hector, you've been awesome, by the way. 
I really like Raichu. I feel like it's, as far as the, the peak, what? It has Volt Absorb. That's so cool. Um, I feel like, um, for whatever reason, Raichu, I guess because Pikachu is like the big mascot, Raichu, for a lot of people, is just not forgotten about. I wouldn't say that, but it's just not like nobody, nobody I've talked to really loves Raichu. Um, and I do. I really like Raichu. I remember facing it or seeing it, I guess, for the first time in the uh, anime. Lieutenant Surge, of course, had it, and it was so sick. Like, I loved that. I thought that was awesome. Uh, let's heal up here, guys. We have officially made it to Verdant Turf Town, which is excellent. Um, but I don't actually think there's a ton we can do here, to be honest. We'll check the Mart really quick. Ooh, we do have a random Mart. Hardstone? Whipped Dream. So that's how creamy. <laughs> Uh, yay. Um, <laughs> anyway, uh, let's, let's explore the town. Not doing a Pokemon contest. That was terrible. Always hate the contest. We talked about that before, but, uh, so we definitely can teach Rock Smash to Amon. I don't really want to, but, um, I kind of hate Rock Smash. It's a terrible move. All right, but that does mean we can get through the tunnel if we need to, which we will in the future. That's super easy and helpful to do, so I think it's probably worth it. Thanks. All right. <laughs> um, so I already went there. Hi, we didn't talk to you yet. We'll go in here. I've, I'm in the mood to watch and I haven't in a long time. Uh, if anybody out there is a Studio Ghibli fan, uh, How's Moving Castle? I haven't watched that movie in a very long time and I love that movie. It's so cool. I remember watching that as a kid and it was so, I don't know, it was just fun. Um, I guess it makes the most sense that it's River, despite it being kind of a bad move. Um, We'll, we'll do it, I guess. Ugh, I hate this, but it's fine. Um, anyway, yeah, I like haven't watched that movie in forever and I kind of want to. I might while I'm doing some work today, I might see if I can find it and throw it on. Oh, we have to fight you. OK, we're going to do the rock smash thing. I think there's maybe an item or two down below as well. So we might. OK, sure. Yeah, just have a Zekrom. Totally fine. <laughs> Jeez. Uh, what? Um, this is where I wish I had like Flygon, right? Bulldoze would be fun. Um, but we're just going to go into clear here. We should resist the. OK, it didn't go for it. I thought it would go for a stab electric move and it just didn't. Now, what do we go for? I don't know. I'm just going to Fury Cutter. It's not going to be very strong, but it boosts every time. Please don't para. Yeah, that did very little. All right, so Fury Cutter will build. So as you can see, it does way more. Well, that was a crit, but it does more damage every single time, which is awesome. Question is, can we knock it out now? Uh, I don't want to risk it, but also what else do we do? I'm going to go river, maybe. I just hope it doesn't derage again. Uh, that's really the most annoying thing. OK, Thunder Fang. We have motor drive. I forgot we had motor drive. <laughs> wow, that was so good. I should have just done this from the beginning. That was so silly. I I completely forgot we had motor drive. That's amazing. It didn't do it. What? OK, but we do outspeed and we do know that. So I'm just going to flame charge. Knowing that this isn't very effective, but it doesn't need to be. We just need to do a little bit. Wow. OK, well, Zekrom was terrifying. Let's not fight another Zekrom. Well, 24 on River. Loving it. Do have to be pretty careful here, but that's fine. Claire, level 22. Of course. <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> I'm so confused. I mean, Angel, but like if this has D-Rage, 
I don't know that I can very well claim Dragon Rage Claws at this point. We've got three badges. Oh my god, it does. Oh, shoot. I don't know what to do. I can Draining Kiss. Let's try it. That's the best thing. It's gonna be... Oh, I thought it was super effective, and it's not... Oh no, we're gonna lose Angel, aren't we? Okay, we didn't. That was a crit. <laughs> I don't, like, I can't swap out into anything. That's kind of the problem. I think we go Water Pulse Confusion, just max damage. Confused. Yes! Oh, come on, please hit yourself. Please don't do this to me. Angel, I'm so sorry. I can't claim Dragon Rage Claws. A after three badges, I feel like that's way too far. I just, I couldn't do anything. Like, we were gonna... Anything I swapped into was then gonna be within death range. Um, and so I didn't feel comfortable going for anything, and I think that's fair. Um, but Angel, I'm so sorry. That's our starter, too. I was just talking about how great Angel's been this whole time. Dang it! Why, why Zekrom and Reshiram? Like, what the heck just happened? Alright, well, let's... Gosh darn it, dude. That is our third death of the series, and it was a good one. We've had two really good ones. CDOT also, I mean, I like Shiftry. It's not a great mod, but it's a cool mod. Um, what level does- it has Contrary. <laughs> uh, what level does this evolve? Do this holding a prism seal and trade it to initiate an evolution. Um. That's not correct here, is it? Uh. So it requires a high beauty stat. Um, I mean, we do also have the ability to swap the Mewtwo, as in make Mewtwo a non-Mega and use it. Um, but I don't love that. <sighs> hmm. I wish we had a better option here. We could evolve Ninkata and get two Pokemon, just to see. Um, you know, for now, I'm gonna throw Brianna on the team. Uh, I really like Brianna. <sighs> should we get Flygon instead? I think it should be Flygon, actually. Well, I say that. Yeah, it should be, right? Because it already, like, it's got more damage output now. Um, I feel like that's better. Uh, we can also train it up a little easier. Dang, dude. Um, Reshiram and Zekron. Oh, we should have definitely healed up. Let's go do that really quick. What the heck was that? That's the craziness that is a randomizer. Like, it feels like game ending when you get to a, such a situation like that, because... I mean, truthfully, it could have been. I mean, thankfully, we only lost one Mon. It wasn't gonna be a game ender, but it was like, it felt like that because it's a Zekrom first with Dragon Rage and then a Reshiram with Dragon Rage. And those are both just naturally crazy Pokemon anyway. Um, but to like have to face both in a battle when you're only this far in the game is crazy. Absolutely crazy. Um, it's just ridiculous, dude. All right, well, let's... Yes, do it. Did we have to teach Rock Smash? That's annoying. Agronite, cool. Oh, geez. All right, so now that pathway is opened, which is helpful. Um, that takes us back to Rustboro City, um, which will be nice if we need to, which we will, 
technically we'll need to come back this like the way we're going now uh at some point after the mount chimney uh meteor falls stuff so it'll be a nice little circle back oh well agronite and found a lair on um we're gonna run down this way uh it's just the glasses isn't it all right we're just gonna go what time is it it's 30 minutes i'm so pissed off man i'm so mad I hate that we lost specifically Angel. I'm really sad we lost anybody because we've been doing really well. I mean, it's three gym badges in. We've only lost three Mons, which is pretty good, but it sucks to lose a Mon, like especially your starter. It feels so bad. Um, regardless, guys, what we are going to do, <coughs> excuse me, is oh, see this cutscene and then we're going to call it a day. Oh, <laughs> uh, geez. Let's save the game right here. So sad. All right. We got more encounters coming up very, very shortly, guys. We have got the route above here, which I believe is 111, maybe. Uh, there's Route 112, I think, too. There's Gi or Fiery Path. There's all kinds of fun stuff. So we're going to make our way through some of this next area, hopefully getting a lot of cool encounters along the way. If we can get a good solid water type, I would be very happy to swap something on the team. We definitely need it. But other than that, I think we're good to go. Uh, I'm so sorry, Angel, but... We're going to make some progress in the next episode, and I can't wait. So definitely stay tuned for that. I love you guys very much. I hope you have a fantastic day. I'll see you again very soon.